It's Mac the Guru. We are back. Today I'm talking to Mari Harwick in the Pivot Podcast, reviewing that. Y'all know I do the power, book two, book threes, the regular power, the power book fours, all of that. If this your first time here, check out the other content. We got hip hop, sports, uh, reactions, all type of stuff on the channel. So just check it out. Now, this interview with Amari, with Ryan, with Fred, with Channing was dope. And it was so inspirational. But Amari Harwood broke down a lot of stuff about power because that's what they started talking about. And he gave it up in the interview. He talked about the ending, how he didn't like the ending. He talked about his salary, how he was underpaid, you know, which I couldn't believe the salary he was getting when he said, I said, God, I can't believe it. Because he literally was the face of the network. Like, I wasn't watching Stars Before Power. Not at all. And currently, right now, out of all the powers that we got on there, it ain't no character like Amari Harwood. It ain't no ghost. It's nobody that's equivalent where you say, yeah, he like he like ghosts, you know. They on the same level, you know. Now, they got actors that's is good, like, you know, Tate, you know, the Tate brothers, they great, great actors and stuff, you know, that's equivalent. But, no, they ain't got no character that's like, ghost no no way now he meant a lot as a character because of the dynamic that he played you know how he changed it up in different environments us as black males we do that when we at home when we outside when we back in the hood when we did not saying everybody sell dope i know that ain't true but i'm saying how we gotta switch it up you know and then he expired to be more. He wanted to be more with the politics and stuff. And he couldn't get there because it's people holding him back. It's people that want him to stay where he was at. We all go through that too. When you like, nah, man, I want to switch it up. I want to do the, 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 the. People start acting like, yo, you ain't spending as much time with me. Yeah, dog. Our relationship is our relationship. That ain't going to change, but I got to go. I got to. Yeah. Come on, dog. You know, people want you to stay where you want to be. And he was striving for more. And many of us do the same. So watching that character all those years and then seeing the ending was just like, come on, man. Really? Like, this is how they going to end it? Really? Nobody liked the ending, let's be real. And Amari literally said in this interview, he wanted a different ending. And the ending that he said was fire. With the man on fire, Denzel, life for a life for Tommy, you know, that would have been fire. But what would have been more fire? If he would have survived. I don't know if Courtney didn't recognize that was like, let me just make him survive. Or the, the network and Courtney and 50 was just like, yo, we need we need uh these next shows, so let's just kill them to help with these next shows. That, that probably what it was. That probably was their mindset. But it's no character on these other shows that the people will look at like we looked at ghosts. No way. Not at all. But, man, I encourage everybody to go watch that interview. Because, it, like, when you watch it, the dynamic, they talked about, you know, the racial element with him having a white wife, too. They talked about that. But the the interview and the dynamic of the interview, you watch it, you just like, man, I just, I just want to get up and go. I want to do something. It's just inspirational watching it, man. So make sure y'all check that out. And another thing. Before we get out of here, one key tale that that character meant so much is because when I do the Power Book 2 reviews, when I do the Power Book 4 reviews, people still say, Ghost coming back. They still say that to this day. <laughs> I'm like, dog, Ghost ain't coming back because I didn't seen enough Amari Harwick interviews to where he didn't like how it ended and 
his salary wasn't all that until you know towards the end but he bent, he built the whole company you know so he didn't like the ending so why would he come back you know what i'm saying like oh he gets shot by his son and that's that's how you go out that's the ending C- come on come on man you know so i'm i'm with him on that uh for sure but check out the interview and then let me know y'all thoughts of what i'm saying and then the interview you know and did you take it and look at it and see it as an inspiration like i did man it's mac the guru if you're still here make sure you sub to the channel click that like button and as always y'all be easy be safe peace